Virgo. We are looking for love for November. So we are doing love reading for November 2022. See what's going on with you. What is going on for Virgo? Hopefully I don't get like forgetting Virgo. I need to get a little sign and put it up where it says like <clears throat> what zodiac I'm on. Sometimes I fucking forget. All right, we got one. We got one. Unrequited love. Spooky. Some of you could be missing somebody. The card says there's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep the relationship going. Oh. That's unfortunate. What else for Virgo? When else for Virgo spirit? Yeah. <clears throat> we can wait for him to pop out. Uh, this could be the one. Mm. Okay. This could be the one. Somebody could have met somebody. Maybe some, you know, I don't know. This feels more like, yeah, it feels more like new love. It does feel like new love. But there could be... I don't know maybe there's a lack of chemistry here i don't know let's find out i don't know what to say i want one more though i want to see what else comes out i want to see what this is oh no 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 we're not doing this but you got codependency i'm gonna look at that as a strong liking to somebody you know like a strong strong attraction <laughs> And you probably feel like this strong attraction to this person, like, you know, they're the ones. They're the one. I'm going with that. Oh, the cards are all messed up. So, I suck at shuffling cards, so don't be looking, looking, looking. Look, but don't look. You know, look and don't pick it up. <laughs> don't put it in the comments. <laughs> don't put it in the comments. Don't do that. This is a work in progress, um, Virgo. Uh, yeah, for sure. And I really should have, like, gathered these cards together because they just feel weird. Anyway, what else for Virgo? We got this super attractive cold dependency card sitting on the table. I mean, something that's just like, ooh, and they stuck to it. <laughs> they like it a lot. You got the Page of Swords, right? Okay, so you could be thinking of somebody. This page, you know, we bring in some messages in too, right? Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, somebody sees someone. It's beautiful. This could be the one. They have everything. He or she is great. I like them a lot. more <sighs> you can think about this person we call this pendency here you think about this person a lot gosh that's, that's, that's a good thing right could be maybe not codependent excitement and curiosity yeah i definitely feel like you know some of you like when you're thinking you know you're thinking about this person and you know, and even in a, in a, in a sexual way, right. In an exciting way that that's for some of you, like, that's what you think of them a lot. Like you feel like they, like they're, they're beautiful. Like you like, oh my God, like I want to be with this person. I want to do all kinds of things to this person, right? You, they're pretty, they're attractive to you, right? You love the way they look. That's what I'm trying to say. Oh, yeah, we got King of Wands, right? Visionary leader. Yeah, this person, I mean, they, I don't know, I feel like, you know, they, in some way, they turn you, they turn you on, right? You're captivated, you know, by this person, right? For some of you, you'll do anything, anything they ask. <laughs> hmm. That's how beautiful you think they are. He's a 
off them all day. That's a lot. But I'm going to go ahead and just take them, though. So you got justice. Like, here comes the soul contract, the codependency, karma. You know, I play on, on that. So I can tell you with this coming in for sure now, uh, with soul contract here, with justice here, like, this is, like, for people who are in, the, you know, those those relationships that are just, like, you know, it was painful, they ended, you know, they coming back again. And you guys um, know who this is. Like, yeah, you got uh, the Ace of Swords. Like, you know, like, who this is. Like, as I'm speaking to you, you know who this is. This is for, you know, just certain certain people, particularly with this deck. This is, like, it's a karmic feeling deck. I said that in another reading because... um. I said, I noticed that when I use this deck, you know, um, it pulls in like energies of like people who are in karmic cycles because it never fails to come out when I, when I use that deck, you know, success and recognition, right? So yeah, I feel like this is coming towards you guys, like you're going to be made aware of this. And for some of you, this coming back of this person is making you happy. Like, you know, I, you, you recognize it, like you can feel it, like you know, with uh, recognition, like I, you feel it, you know, it's coming. What's down here? Reevaluation, right? For some of you, you know, reevaluation, like it's coming back. Could be a, it could be a water sign, could be earth sign, right? What else? Could be air. That's here. Oh, shit, all the signs is here. Never mind. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see what else. In love, in love for Virgo. I hope the um, energy stays light. You know, if someone's coming back from your past, like they could be the one. I, you know, never mind. <clears throat> I was going to say, like, maybe there's a bright side to this. Like, you know, somebody comes back from your past and it just works out beautifully. You know, no. You got stuck. So, somebody's definitely stuck on somebody. Like, physical attraction, they stuck on, you know. Um, you know, you got meeting someone new. This person definitely wants to start over. For some of you, this is your first go around because you got, this could be the one. So some of you just met somebody, right? Somebody new. You feel like you've known them like fucking forever. <laughs> like they, you feel, you feel close to them, you know, you feel close to them, right? You got the universe has a plan. No shit. We know that anything karmic is universal. Uh, you know, universe you know, um, has a plan. Anything that's karmic, that's universal, right? It says pay attention to the details. That one came out. Yep, 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 yep. Because this is that devil energy. <laughs> yes, you got sadness and loss. That's been coming out a lot. Though you got storm brewing. And this is somebody coming back from your past, like asking for something new. You know, be mindful, pay attention, pay attention. Yeah. For some of you, this person may reach out maybe what else i'm gonna take one more of these oh no i just want one all right yeah i can't do it that's how you're gonna feel right after the storm <laughs> after the storm with this person if you let them back you're gonna be like yo i can't fucking do this i can't do this i can't do this i can do this why did i do this why i do this There's a lot of readings. I know this isn't for everybody, but it's showing you. All right, what else, Spirit? For those who are, let's see what else Spirit has to say. Decisions, right? Yep. You could be thinking about this shit, right? <laughs> Big time. You got the Queen of Wands, like, you know, like, yep. For those of you who are like, you know, suck attached to someone's, you know, beauty and thinking about them, you know, like all the time, here she is. She's right here, you know, with the Queen of Wands. And for others of you, like this decision is, is, is about this, you know, this, this could be a uh, fire sign, you know, with this queen sitting here all fired up, right? 
uh, you could be with a fire sign, but you're making a decision. You could be making a decision about a fire sign, you know, but I don't think it's good for you. I don't. You're going to feel defeated. You're going to feel drained. Like, whoever this person is, like, you know, I mean, they're karmic, so go figure. You know, they're going to drain the life out of you, right? You're going to go from being that fiery queen of wands to, like, a burnt out bowl of, like, ash, you know, or some sh sugar, sugar like that. Yeah, the devil. Oh, I can't make this shit up. This person's the opposite. They might be all over the place. All sad. Yeah, you got conflict. You got uh, towers here. Like, uh, it's in reverse, though, even though I don't take reversals. Maybe you can avoid this, right? Because it kind of fell in reverse. Maybe you can avoid this, right? All right. So now we know. We know what's coming in for you in November. So now that you know what's coming, you can avoid this, right? You can miss this disaster for some of you. Miss the disaster. Why can't we have a good storm, right? Some of you are going to be determined, you know, maybe to even see, you know, if this will work. Like at this time, you know, it'll be able to come around, you know. You got mirror in here. You, you know, you kind of know or you feel like this person is for you. You know, mirroring contracts, they all come hand in hand, right? So you got mirroring. Yeah, of course. Right, you are, you know, you guys, this is exactly what you're gonna be doing. I'm gonna be back and forth. Oh, because you did this, you know, I did that. You know, it's like you got guide here. You know, like don't do it. You know, you got you got new direction. You know, take take a different path. You know, make a different choice. You know, so you don't run into this tower. You know, you don't want it. You don't want it. You know, separation. I do feel like that's where it will go. That'll be the direction. You got new direction, you know. You just end up in separation. Yeah. This person, they got shadow walk on the bottom of the deck. They ain't right. All right, that's enough. That's enough. Let's get a little heart. And if you want, I can try to pull some zodiac signs. For you, Virgo. Surrender. Some of you are definitely going to say yes when this person, you know, um, comes to you, right? Or I feel for this, I almost feel like this is for people who this person's already in your life. They're already there. For some of you who met somebody new, you know, there's an energy here to surrender to that, right? You could share a lot with this person. You could like them a lot with codependency, chilling on the board so heavily. All right, that's enough. We got two time, yeah. So we got surrender. Am I gonna be able to read this without my glasses? Probably not. I don't even think I'm gonna try. I was gonna try to struggle. It says surrender. At times we must surrender the old before something new can enter our lives, let go, and all will work out. So yes, yeah, so some of you know that you're being guided to let go. Of this right and for some of you you're just being guided into you know something you've waited for like because you got time here you are trying too hard give it time so yeah because all right so that says a lot you know with this right um there is codependency you know here so there could be somebody trying a little bit too hard you know um even to like get back into this <laughs> back into this relationship you know, and somebody here had a separation. So somebody here, if there's someone coming back, or whoever's coming back, they could have separated, you know, um, from someone else. But honestly, I just see, like, that's just how, you know, you guys are going to, you know, find this, um, Virgo. So don't take anybody back from your past. That's it. Good luck.